Hello and welcome to So Swiss Game Box. Thank you for stopping by the channel. It's time for some Doki Doki Literature Club. So grab your seats and snacks because we are gonna start. Once Yuri packs up, I walk her out the front door. Thank you very much for having me today. No problem. I'm glad I was able to help, Yuri. Just let me know if there's anything else you need me to bring tomorrow. I will. Well then... Yuri fidgets. I guess I'll see you tomorrow. Wait! Crud, I kind of said that without thinking. About today. It's fine that we didn't have as much time as we wanted. Because we can do this again. Whenever you want, you can come over. Or we can go out somewhere. Like um, for lunch or something. Ah, I forgot. You don't like going out much. As I stumble over my words, Yuri simply smiles bashfully. Anyway... You know what I'm trying to say, so... You are very thoughtful, so sweet. Yuri takes a step closer to me, then briefly squeezes my hand. Huh? She takes a step closer, and then squeezes my hand. Oh god, no, not this again! Please, no! I kind of like that about you. Oh man, we're so close. Well, come on, so calm down. How am I supposed to respond to that? Um, I don't know. But I don't get a chance to. As Yuri suddenly pulls back. <gasps> S Sayuri? Eh? Ah. Sayuri? She's here? Ha hi. So sweet. Oh, crud. S Sayuri. Uh, j just now. We weren't. Eh <laughs> It's okay, so sweet. I just stopped by to say hi. Uh, um. Well, it's nice to see you. I'm sorry, but I'm already on my way to leave. Aw, uh, really? That's too bad. I'm sorry. But we'll all be together at the festival tomorrow, so... So that's fine, right? Of course! Sayuri beams. This is awkward. Yeah, so... I'll see you tomorrow. Clearly embarrassed, Yuri hurries off. Sayuri waves goodbye after her. Sayuri. I thought you didn't want to come over today. <laughs> well, I tried staying in my room, but my imagination was being really mean to me. Imagination? Huh? So, I had to come here and see it for myself. See what exactly? What are you talking about? You know... How much fun you are having with 
Yuri and how close you got to her it makes me really happy that you've made such good friends that's all that matters to me Sayuri why are you saying all this tears start to fall down Sayuri's face That's all that matters to me. Why am I feeling this way, so sweet? I'm I'm supposed to be happy for you. Why does it feel like my heart is splitting in half? It hurts so much. Everything hurts so much this would be so much better if I could just disappear disappear no hell no Sayuri don't say that please it's true so sweet if I wasn't here then you wouldn't have to waste your sympathy on me you wouldn't have to put up with me being selfish Monica was right. Monica? Huh? I should just... Monica? Monica was right about what? Tell me, what did she say to you? Huh? Sayuri. What I said before is true. I'm not gonna let this continue. Caring about you like this isn't the burden your mind is making it out to be. It's something that makes me happy. It's something that I wouldn't trade for anything else. So, even it takes an entire lifetime, I'm going to be by your side until you don't feel any more pain. I promise. But, but... Sayuri looks away. I put a hand on her shoulder to reassure her. I'm scared, Sir Sui. I'm really scared. What are you scared of, Sayuri? I'm here with you. I'm scared that... that I might like you more than you like me. Sayuri? It's true, isn't it? I was weak and started to like you too much. I did this to myself. So sweet. I like you so much that I want to die. Huh? That's how I feel. And... And... That's enough, Sayuri. I don't want you to hurt anymore. I slide my hand down Sayuri's arm and squeeze her hand in my own. Do you remember how I said I always know what's best for you? Do you still believe me? Do you still have faith in me? Wordless, Sayuri nods. Even if you don't understand all of your own feelings, I know what you need the most right now. And that's what I'm going to give to you. Sayuri, you'll always be my dearest friend. And I always will be by your side. I promise.
What you need most is for things to be like they've always been. Monica told me the truth. She told me how much happier you seemed after I joined the club. I know you're struggling with some really difficult feelings right now. But, please, trust me that I know what's best and what will make you happy in the end. I promise I'll help get things back to the way they were. I... I... see... Sayuri forces a smile through an incredibly pained expression. <laughs> Is this what it feels like to get stabbed in the chest? I should write a poem about this. Sayuri. It's okay. This is just my punishment, remember? For being so selfish. So please. Please don't worry about these stupid feelings. I know you're right. I knew this whole time that there's no happiness down that path. That's why I came here. So I could get the answer I needed to hear. And the other thing... You're also right that I just wanted to go back to the way it was. I realize that now. You really do know me better than anyone, so sweet. I'll trust you with anything. Anything at all. So... Sayuri's smile finally breaks. All of a sudden, she turns around and drops to her knees. Ah! Clutching her head with both hands, she screams as loudly as she can. I am so shocked that I don't know how to react. Sayori looks over her shoulder and flashes me one more weak smile before turning around and running off. Sayori, wait! <sighs> God damn it! What's happening? What is going on? I'm left helplessly standing in front of my house. Why am I feeling so horrible about this? There's nothing more that I could have done. The most I can do is support Sayuri through her feelings and help her on the path that's right. But I'm having as much trouble understanding Sayuri's feeling as she is. Even though I can comfort her, I keep wondering if I should be doing something more or something different. Something more, huh? Something different. Different routes, maybe? I know, these thoughts will continue to plague me until things are back to the way they were. I'm going to give it everything I've got. I'll save you, Sayori. I'll save you. Sayori will always be my dearest friend. And I'll do whatever it takes to put a smile on her face every day. It's the day of the festival. Hmm. Did I make the wrong choice with Sayori? No, that can't be right. I don't know. 
Um, how about this? How about if I go back and go through Natsuki and then Sayuri's route and see what happens after that? Yeah, that's... I think that's the best way. Sayuri, wait for me. I'll save you. I promise.